This video shows uh, some of the things that you can do with a Wikipedia article to help uh, analyze it for the subject uh, uh, analysis assignments. Of course, there's the article itself, and one of the things that's interesting here um, is if you look at the references area towards the bottom of the page, uh, there'll be a list of several books, uh, and then there's a further reading. Uh, one of the things that I did for the sample was to see if any of these books were listed uh, on the uh, more reading in our textbook and see if our textbook author is uh, using the same experts and sources as our uh, as the Wikipedia authors are. Um, also on the article page, um, if you look at the view history link, uh, you can see um, uh, what the changes were made in the past and when they were made. What's neat about this page is it shows the most recent 50 changes uh, to the page by default. So I can scroll down and, for example, I can see that the 50th change uh, was way back in August of 2011. You can also see uh, the actual users who were um, making those changes if you want to look at more information about those users. But what I like to do is to look at the uh, contributors page. Uh, this will show you... Um, the um, uh, contributors who made the most uh, number of changes. Here's one, uh, D. Smith, one USA. Their most recent change was way back in 2007. And if I click on the username for that uh, 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 editor, it'll go to that user's page. But I can see that this user is currently blocked, so that there are some issues with that particular user. Um, let's go go back to that page. On the um, talk page. You can get a sense of the issues that uh, Wikipedia authors are having on this page. Um, there are a couple of uh, projects within Wikipedia, like there's a politics project, they give them a C grade. Uh, the economics project it also gives it a C grade. And um, if you scroll down, you can see um, by these headings here uh, what the uh, main issues are. Uh, again, if you look at the um, dates of the entries, you can see um, uh, when things were changed. All very interesting things for us to look at uh, as we consider um, the process and um, the methods by which knowledge is created. We get a live view of that with Wikipedia uh, much more than we would when we're looking at a textbook.